hidden USB ports are hidden all over the world and hold secret files for you to download. What started off as a single person and their idea to enlighten and unplug the community, as well as stick it to the man, a little, has grown into a global phenomenon. In 2010, Aaron Barthol wanted to create an anonymous, offline, peer-to-peer file-sharing network in public space. He called them dead drops. In the wake of all sorts of anti-piracy litigation, ad campaigns, and laws being made, this idea has caught on worldwide to the tune of over 1170 dead drop locations. If you've ever wondered why there's a USB randomly sticking out of a wall, this is why. Just plug it in and you're ready to download anything that seems interesting or upload something of your own. When you're done, you simply unplug and walk away. You might not even notice the USB in Pont des Arts Paris until you take a closer look. That's why there are photos like these to show you exactly where to go. It's like a treasure hunt. You never know what you're going to find. Here we have one in Folsom, California, in front of the Palais de Tokyo in Paris. Hanoi, Vietnam, even Dacre, Senegal. A sticker was left to mark this dead drop location in Cagliari, Italy. Just one map as a sample of the expansion of the project. Here is a copy of the dead drops. Read me text file. It reads, for everything you do, you are responsible for yourself. I am excited to look up the nearest dead drops on my next vacation. Imagine going on a European trip with some time to kill. You find a dead drop location and download some photos with directions to an awesome hidden location. Maybe locals helping you find something special off the beaten path. New music by up-and-coming artists or even scavenger hunt clues and directions. The possibilities are endless and adventures unimaginable. A dead drop is a naked piece of passively powered universal serial bus technology embedded into the city, the only true public space. In an era of growing clouds and fancy new devices without access to local files, we need to rethink the freedom and distribution of data. The dead drops movement is on its way for change. Aaron Barthol. What are your thoughts? Let us know in the comments.